If you can get it there, he'll eat it. Definitely. Oh, he, he's turning to it. He's going to eat it right now. You got it. You got it. <laughs> yes. There's a big one to eat it. Oh. No, that's a different one. Look how big they are. Oh, he's a giant. Gosh, dude. Oh, my God. There's a huge snake right next to me. Oh my God, Cody. He's gonna eat it. He's huge. Dude, he's a big one. What's happening, people? Welcome back to another video. We are gonna be doing some bank fishing today. We're gonna be throwing some big jigs to try to catch some big bass. Got a few boys with me today. I read some of the comments in the last bank fishing video and you guys said, you know what, Noah? We wanna see some more bank fishing content. So we're out here today. Gonna be trying to film a few episodes for y'all. And more importantly, get on some really big fish. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. And drop some comments down below on some of the bank fishing videos, like ideas on what you guys wanna see next. Got my boy Connor with me. If you had to catch one big one today, can you put a number on what you think it's gonna be? We're going for eight plus, seven plus maybe, but we'll see. And we also have Cody, he's gonna be tagging along fishing with us today. And this is the place that we're gonna be fishing. Pretty big pond, never been here before. Cody's caught a few really good fish out here, so I'm excited about it. Let's go ahead and hop into this video. I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I'm throwing, the whole rig up process, and then we're gonna get right out on this pond and just try to get to work. I saw recently you guys enjoyed the big jig video. So I was like, you know what, let's go pond fishing with big jigs. I'm also gonna have this thunder cricket by striking on and I just put a little caffeine chat on the back. It actually looks really good. We're gonna be rigging this one up, Custom Pro Mach 2. We're gonna take this trap off. And then this is a Custom Pro Mach 2 and we're gonna be putting this jig on. This is the tuber grade skipping jig by striking. It's like a green pumpkin with a blue swirl. I think it's a great little natural color, especially in the pond that we're gonna be fishing today. It's more of clear water. We don't really have stained water. And the crawl that I'm gonna be pairing up is a rage crawl and this is actually in summer crawl. You know my favorite color. It's got green pumpkin, a little bit of chartreuse on the back. I just pulled up with some 17 pound fluorocarbon as well. So we're all good on that end. We're just gonna tie her up and uh, get out there, get to fishing. All right, it is time to get it started today. Got my thunder cricket, little thunder chicken right here. And got my jig on the other rod. Got my man, Cody. Let's get it. Connor. You boys ready? Absolutely. You boys ready? All right, so there's a, a, ba a bass, like, I think he's on bed right here. I'm gonna, if I catch one first cast, is that gonna mean some bad luck? Cause I'm probably gonna catch this fish. Check our drag too. I'll throw this for a cast or two. Just get my setup right. Yeah, he's about to eat it. Yeah. Dude. I can't tell if that's just a spot in the water if that's a fish. Oh, there's a lot of cover right here. Should catch one. Kind of like stumps and stuff right here. Maybe it'd be deeper over there. Uh oh, what'd you get? This one wasn't as finicky. I saw my bait, went, over, went right over to it and, and ate it. Nice. But yeah, the rest of them have been finicky, but I think this shady area is gonna be the money. Oh yeah, for yeah. sure. That was nice though, you got the first one. Guys, we walked all the way from over there all the way around 
and the bass have just been so it's super shallow and like the jig even hopping on the bottom just creates like a big just bunch of dust coming off not dust but it's a big cloud of mud and nasty stuff but this bank right here has some shade on it hopefully to drop off a little deeper down here and we'll get on some of these fish A little better. Fish number two. Squeaky. Just a little bit better. It's crazy because the ones that we've seen, bro, are big. Like, yeah, we've seen some small ones, but we've seen a ton of four pounders. Just can't get them to eat. So that last pond, I don't know what was going on. Just didn't work out. You know, it happens. You go to places, you don't really catch any. Cody caught two small ones on that Texas rig, but that jig, it was just too heavy. I know if we would have tied on a fluke and fished that, it we probably could have caught around 10 fish but we're actually at a new place right now if you guys saw one of the recent videos like a few weeks ago maybe about a month ago now um we came out on cody's mom's pond with a kayak and i caught that like eight pounder that eight plus really big one and so we're out here today and we're gonna be bank fishing we haven't bank fished this pond yet so i think we can really hook into a giant like there's big ones out there there's a lot of small ones but there's also some tanks so we're gonna start covering some water. It's getting a little windy too, so I do apologize about that. But we're gonna keep tossing in this jig. I have high hopes. We gotta make it happen right now. It's been a little tough grinder, but we're gonna get it started, boys. We, I have high hopes. This water is so clear from the last time that we've been here. What in the world? There's some really big ones in here, Connor. Oh, I got one. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. I had the hooks that sent him so hard. This is my first fish on the jig. Nothing big. Nice. Oh, there we go to start off the big jig video. Little guy. Nothing big. It's a tiny little scrunchy dude. Not even a pound, but <laughs> that was fun catching him. He bit pretty good. I was getting excited. I thought it was going to be a big one. Turn back. Thanks for biting, bud. Now we're starting somewhere. That's how we got to start off today's video. Dude, there's one on bed right there. There's two on bed. Really, really small. I'm gonna catch this one first. I don't even know if he can eat this jig. I'm like, he's on it. Ah, uh, I just pulled that stick. One right there, too. Those little guys are smart. There's a dead bass, too. Oh, there's a decent one. I got like a, not a bad one in front of me, two of them. Uh-oh. He's right on me. Swim off. There's a couple swimming around right here. There's a little guy. He does, I was like popping my rod up. <laughs> what, in the, what in the world are you doing? No, you're not getting my jig. You're just looking at it. Gosh, let's go. Oh, <laughs> we're having a tough day. We really thought that we were gonna smoke them. We've been to two different places. It's just. <laughs> it's not going as planned, but we're still hunting down. We're, we're going to go to a couple more spots after this. And then we have some doggies that have literally followed us from like the other side of the lake. And this one just wants to jump in front of us and spook off all the fish and try to eat our jig. So that would be a lunker though. I'm not going to lie. That'd be a big one. That'd be a PB, wouldn't it? Absolutely. <laughs> hey. <laughs> 
He's a good dog. Come here. This dog pretty much hey. away all of us He's a good boy though. He's having fun. He's having fun. All right, let's go to the next one. You can see, all right, you see that orange leaf next to the, in the middle mm -hmm. of the slop? Yeah. Go out from that? He's facing oh, yeah, this yeah. way. Do yeah, you see him? him? Yeah, yeah, you can get it there. He'll eat it. Definitely. Oh, he, he's turning to it. He's going to eat it right now. You got it. You got it. <laughs> yes. It's a big one too, ain't it? Like a three pounder. Oh, dude. <laughs> that was so cool. Did he, Did he come off? Yeah. Let me see. Dude, it's solid two and a half. Nice. Dude, that was perfect. You see him turn around, dude, just turned, eat it. He turned for it right when it hit the water. Dude, that was so dope. Oh. Wait. Dude, that's a giant. Oh, look, look. Dude, that's a freak. Dude, he took my he took my thingy. Look at him. Pick up that and throw the wacky at it or something. Oh, dude. Pick up, my, pick up that rod. That one's got a crawl on it. Dude, that, that was a tank, dude. That one had to have been five plus. Should I went for it right when it hit. That's him, right? That big, like, like right there. Yeah. Oh, it is. He yeah. turned. Oh. No, that's a different one. Look how big they are. Look how many. Look how big. Dude, give me your. Give me. Let me grab my rod. Watch this, dude. We're about to film the craziest clip ever. Oh my god. I'm gonna release him right back. Look how big he is. Look how big he is. Oh. Dude, he's a giant. Are you Connor? Dude, that's like a six pounder. Dude, we have a. <laughs> dude, never in my life have I had that happen. Dude. dude, we have three fish on right now. All right, let's get these back in the water. I, I want to take care of them. Oh, dude, I just had to do that. Oh my god. Dude, that's like a four and a half, five pounder. There was another one, too. I don't know where he went, but that's a tank. Look at <laughs> How do we just do that? We just got start. We've been trying all day. Dude, this is why you don't give up, ain't it? Didn't give up. This is why you don't. Dude, that's a giant. All right, get those two back in the water. That is crazy. Oh, dude. Dude, that is insane, Connor. This is a freaking large one, too. Now, that is the type of fish that we want today. That is a freaking tank. Oh my gosh, that has to be one of the craziest moments of bass fishing that I've ever seen. Was that not just crazy, Connor? Crazy. He flipped in there, caught that fish. Like we saw a couple more. I flipped in there, hooked that one, threw him up on the bank, like grabbed that other rod real quick and then caught this big one. I did not want her to swim off. And that is a tank right there. Let's get her back in the water. We have a lot more fishing to do. We've been fishing for two minutes. Like, oh man. Cody's gone too. Cody like ran off. That that fish is over four. There she goes. She's trying to get through the slop. Oh my gosh. All right. Guys, that has to be one of the craziest moments I've ever witnessed. There's one more bass over here that we can see. I'm gonna let Connor throw on it. I'm gonna see if I can get it on the big camera. We're about to film a banger for y'all. Hit that like button. We got some, we got some heat coming up. Perfect, dude. Perfect. You're about to catch this fish. God, dude, that was a different one that bit you. Oh, huge one. Dude, ooh, ooh. She, she tried to chase it when I was reeling it back in. Connor, watch this, it's gonna be a giant. Look. Dude, it's giant. Oh, I got him snagged, what? Or no, no, I don't. Yeah, I do, dude. I just snagged a dang five pounder in the tail. I'm just confused, dude. I watched her eat it and I got her in the tail. I did not mean to do that, but see when you're sight fishing bass, dude, it's hard to watch them and feel them at the same time. It's like your, your senses don't combine well, <laughs> but that's a freaking tank. He's like almost, let's say four pounds. I did not mean to snag her though. I, I hate that, but she's okay. Get her right back in the water. She's gonna swim off. There she goes. Oh. <laughs> she looks like a tank in the water, bro. Oh my gosh. Just thick, thick head. Yeah. Oh, dude, she's like a seven pounder. Dude, he's on me right now. He's like seven pounds. Dude, that might be bigger, Connor. Let me see if I can catch her right here. There's a snake too.
Dude, he was like seven pounds. I'm not even, maybe eight. Where'd he go? I don't know, dude. He was nosing behind it and he was just about to eat it and he swam off. <laughs> oh, he like was ready to eat too, dude. I don't know what just spooked him off. Like that fish was so big, Connor. I cannot believe I just passed up that opportunity. I don't know where she went, but my, my jig got buried in the grass and she just couldn't find it. Like she had her nose down, but I was too far in the slop. That was a freaking moose though. Wait, so that's the male? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, dude, that fish is big. You see how big she is? There's another one down there that big too. They, they wouldn't hit anything and I walked like pretty far to the other side and then threw back across. Yeah. And he crushed it. Like right when I hit his bed. Really? Cody's got a good one over here. Yeah, that's about three, three and a half. Look at that. That's fat. Parasite that was right next to the hook. Ew. Dude, that's weird. I've never seen anything like that. Fluke fish. That's nice. Was he right off that tree? Yeah, he was right off of that. Nice. Holy. Holy. Dude. Get it, man. Two of them mating. I'm, but I'm right in front of both their noses. <laughs> I need that jig for the thumbnail too. That's heartbreaking. You could probably flip in there and catch. Dude, that's a big. Oh my god, they're bigger than I thought. Look how big that one, that one is. Maybe you can get my jig back. Oh. There's another one right, keep reeling, right right there, you're on, yeah. Oh, the one's about to eat you. Dude, look at him. Oh, he has my jig. Look, he's trying to get it out of his mouth. They're trying to eat it out of each other's mouth. Dude, he didn't catch that fish. Dude, he look at my jig. Just put it in front of his nose. You might eat it. Bro, if you catch my jig back, it's literally hanging out of his mouth and he keeps going like this. Good morning, boys and girls, ladies and gents. We're back out here, early in the morning. We got out here very early. It was about an hour, hour and a half drive from our house. We woke up early, got out here. The sun just came up. We're gonna be trying to catch these fish. If you guys saw, you know, the day previously, it was me and my boy Connor, also had Cody out here. We caught a couple good fish. You know, we started off the day really slow, hit two different places, just wasn't happening. We came out here. Had like the craziest experience where we caught three fish like back to back to back like had all three fish on the bank which was insane and then all of a sudden the bite just cut off and we could not catch any more fish so we're back out here another day beautiful mornings we gotta hook a big one today we gotta catch a large one there's a ton of big fish bedding up on the bank and i know we can make it happen so let's get this video started all right guys we gotta get revenge on yesterday we have to catch a few good fish i'm throwing this menace right here by strike king and summer crawl it's got like chartreuse on one side green pumpkin on the other with a little tiny bullet weight and a ewg there's a few fish that i see right up here in front of us you know me and connor we had that crazy moment where we caught those three fish right over there and then all of a sudden like i didn't have a bite for like two hours or i had a bite but it was just we could not get them to like eat properly but we're gonna catch them today I feel it. Cast around a good bit in here. See if we can catch a few really big fish. Oh, look at that snake. Dude, it's so big. Dude, what is that? What kind of snake is that, dude? That's a freaking giant one. Oh, dude, look at that bass, too. I gotta catch this thing. What kind of snake is that, dude? A big one. Wait. Dude, he just had me. Oh, no. Dude, no. I don't mess with that. I don't know, dude. 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 Oh, my God. Oh. <gasps> dude, I got him. There's a giant. There's a huge snake right next to me. That ain't, dude, that ain't the big one. You saw the back of that first fish, bro. 
Oh my gosh, guys, look at that. Dude, his jaw's like broken. Look at that, guys. <laughs> we were just sitting here, huge snake on the bank. We'll show you guys in a second. He's literally right down there. That's disgusting. I like saw him just going at the water. He's probably what, five foot long? Yeah. That was, that was gross. But look at his mouth. It's like his jaws broke right there. I hate that. It's like it almost healed some itself though. Yeah. I don't know. It's like it's trying to form back together. I don't want to grab him. You know, I want to grab him by the head so I don't hurt him, but that's every bit of three and a half pounds. And even pushing a four pounder, you know, if you had a little more weight on him, but it's a good fish right there. I just don't want to lip him. And come here, let me show you guys this. There's another big one on the bank, so I don't want to spook him. I don't know if you guys can see him down there, but that's a snake. It's like five foot long. He's all the way up on the bank. On that thing's gross, dude. I don't mess with that. There we go, guys. First fish in the second half of this video. And it's a good one. That's, that's almost a four pounder. We're just going to toss her right here. These snakes are freaking me out. Thank you, baby, for biting. She just zooted off. Man, that was awesome. These fish are just chasing bait, and I threw that menace in there and just destroyed it. If I catch one on that standing... What I was saying is if I catch one on that standing tree, it's gonna get in my head because we can't cast at the other ones. He was right on it. Get up here, Bo. What is wrong with their mouths? Look at this. So like how that other one was with his lip. He's got like a big cyst or something on there. It's weird. Nice little two pounder. And all the fish that we've caught have been like up on the bank, you know, mainly bedding. He was right on that standing tree. It looks so good. And what I was trying to get to with that cast is I'm gonna be mad if I catch one here because there's all these standing trees back there, but we can't get to them. So who knows, they could be loaded with bass, but pretty guy right there. Nothing big, but getting somewhere. Thank you, buddy. Oh my God, Cody. He's coming towards me. He's gonna eat it. He's huge. Dude, he's a big one. Judy came out of nowhere. It's like a freaking six ton. Come on, baby. Mm. <laughs> Dude. Oh my gosh, she can't make that up. I was over here fishing for a one pounder and this guy saw my thing just going crazy. And he just got so aggressive and just went over and ate it. That was the easiest fish catch I've gotten all day. Oh my God, that's a tank too. That's a freaking over five pounds. Let me rinse her off. She got a bunch of slop on her. Guys, that's a freaking tank. That is a freaking five pounder right there. You gotta love it. Thick and chunky, nothing crazy, but uh, that's a freaking big one. That's a big one right there. I just can't believe how that went down. I saw him swimming. All of a sudden he noticed my crawl and he was gonna go steal it from that small fish. He wasn't even gonna give him a chance to eat it. And sure enough, she freaking ate it. That's a freaking tank right there. What a way to end off the video. All right, baby. Thank you for biting. You're just a fat toad. What a way to end off the day. Couldn't have ended off that. That's a freaking fat girl. All this grass. There she goes. Well, guys, it has been a grind. Let me tell you, we hit those two ponds the other day. You know, came out here, had a crazy moment. Then the bite just cut off, couldn't really catch any fish. Came out today and uh, we put some work in, guys. It put some time. I think we caught three or four fish today, um, but we put the time in. I mean, I'd say we've been out here for about three hours. Yes, this is a pond that's out here and it's got really big fish in it, but that doesn't always mean that they're gonna bite super easy. And uh, that's what we found out today, but we still got it done. Ended it off with the toad. And uh, if you guys wanna see some more videos like this or you wanna see us come out again, Hit that like button, let me know down below. And uh, yeah, I love you guys so much. Catch y'all in the next video.